what is up everyone welcome to the channel if you're new hit that subscribe button so right now i'm about to get into this video um basically discussing the controversy surrounding balenciaga they even found themselves in some hot water because they're basically peddling you know some very uh morally unsound things so let's get to it Where's the outrage? I'm going to go off for a minute here because Please where do. is the outrage? It's been a week and a half and now we're doing this story. I get it. Thanksgiving was happening and all that. But they tried to hide behind that, right? Maybe this. There is no outrage because the people in power support that and they partake in that behind the scenes. That's why all the people that was on that list haven't been revealed because people in, the, in higher positions are involved in that. So. This will make it through the news cycle. No, it's not, okay? Adidas didn't cut ties 48 hours after Kanye did his whole thing, right? And they exactly. got lambasted for not speaking out against uh, anti-Semitism. This is a week and a half and nobody seems to care that there's little kids involved in this. I can't speak what it's like to be a black man, right? I can't speak what it's like to be a Jewish woman, but I can speak what it's like to be a father of two young boys. And that this type of behavior. When I worked at CBS.com out of a little closet my first show, I was like, I'm going to say this and wear a blue shirt. I got 49 emails saying, maybe wear a purple shirt and maybe don't say this here. Don't tell me this slipped through the cracks right. when you're getting a court case that features child pornography. It's disgusting. Yeah. It's not being talked about because they're involved in it. That's why. And that's what they have on a lot of these uh, celebrities and people in power. And that's what they use to blackmail them and keep them, um, keep them in line. Because a lot of them was on that island. That's why it's not being talked about. And then Balenciaga going to try to don't put out a bullshit statement talking about they didn't know. You know everything that's going on with your company. You spending money on ads and ad campaigns. That's 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 just a, a bullshit excuse. Dusting, it's disturbing. Jeopardy's got to flip their whole production because of w one person said something, but they wanted to be woke and do all that. How many other examples are there? 10, 20, 30, 40 years we're going back to cancel people. But this exactly. slips through the cracks. It's outrageous. And that people aren't outraged and skipping work with their posters and going to the courthouse or going to Balenciaga and stars aren't wiping. Their yeah, because they in, they in bed with them. They in bed with them. Well, they're in bed with them. It's disgusting, but people are still going to support them, still going to buy from them. It's like every year you got something coming out about these different fashion houses and you know, these different conglomerates. But all of them is tied together. It's not just Balenciaga, it's whole Hollywood. You hear about all the stories from the different actors talk about what goes on, you know, in that realm. And a lot of those people is, is on that list and it was on that island. Instagram and That's social media with all their Balenciaga about. gear is disgusting in itself. Don't you tell me, Hollywood, how to live my life or you want me canceled or because you produce something. You're going to go around because Balenciaga pays you a million dollars, two million, five million. Yeah. Kim Kardashian, shame on you. You're a billionaire. You don't need this company. They need you. And for you to take a week and a half to come to, to a conclusion, something. shame on you. Yep. That's because they all been bought off and paid and they're all involved in it. That's why ain't nobody saying anything. This is why we need fathers in our society. Man, respect for Jeff Schroeder. I love that he took his earpiece out. So, yep, because that's what that's going to say. You, you, you shouldn't talk about this. This is what it looks like when a real man speaks up more of this, please. No. We didn't. No. Bullshit. How you, how you a multi-billion dollar company they gonna try to play up that you didn't know that this was going on you're gonna try to blame it on the person you hired to create the campaign you 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 approve of that i know how these i know how that shit go i went to school for art when you're when you're coming up with concepts and stuff there's a lot of brainstorming you send it to um the head, uh, the head director of creative, 
they send it back to you to make uh, changes here and there. You keep revising, you keep revising until you get the final thing. And then once you have the final thing is presented, that's how it goes in the art world. So that was a bunch of bullshit cop out. But yeah, these celebrities been bought. They, a lot of them participate in the shit that you see being uh, peddled. And that's what they're trying to do. They're trying to make pedophilia acceptable. That's why they keep pushing these different agendas and stuff. That's going to pretty much do it for my reaction. As always, appreciate everyone for tuning in. Before you go, be sure to drop a like and a comment below. Let me know what you guys think about this uh, subject. But other than that, until the next one, peace.